share some advice or read some scriptures about refreshing your relationship with God. Yeah, I don't, I do not want to seem too pushy or make you feel uncomfortable, so, I mean, it's totally up to you. You're open. Yeah, I agree. It's better to address problems sooner rather than later, even though it might Start making some changes. The word 
mindlessly watching a screen, you know. I know for a fact that God does not want us living like zombies. kind of 
most humans for the past thousands of years haven't had access to. And that power is that anybody can become an authoritative voice on a topic. And I mean anybody in a negative sense. Ordinary people who haven't gone through the proper training or work or education now have this opportunity to broadcast their opinions um, as fact. Some people do at least. And it's not necessarily good. It's getting harder to determine who is a real authority on, on something. So if you're going through a period, almost done mixing this, I promise. If you're going through a period where you feel like you feel like you're being online a lot, you gotta check in with yourself and ask yourself who are the authoritative voices in my life? And how do I know those voices are trustworthy? Because you are bound on social media to find people taking the place of that authoritative voice talking about moral topics and anything that has something to do with morality automatically has something to do with God. So you need to watch that because that will eventually affect your your faith and your concept of who God is based on who you're listening to. Let me just apply this really quickly to y'all. screen um, screen time app 
He is a God. 
No. 
Myself to the pastor, 